Our special guest this morning, his name is Billy. Actually, bro, welcome to the show. How are you doing? Just so it plays out. Have you, have you heard of Peter Andre back home? Yes, yeah? of course. Do you I want to take him back home with you and do us all a favour? Oh, you don't like him. I met him the other day, really? actually. Yeah. Oh, dear, I know. <laughs> <laughs> now, Ashley, of course, has played a feisty teacher, Kate Ramsey, uh, for five years. And uh, what a time she's had. Uh, when she first arrived, her mum was killed almost immediately in a hit and run, <laughs> forcing Kate to abandon her dreams of becoming a dancer. And she's now got to care for uh, her younger siblings, Harry and Sophie. She's now a student teacher at Erinsborough High. But uh, Kate's the kind of teacher you may have been warned about at school, judging from all the tonsil tennis she's been playing <gasps> with student Noah. Now, how old was Noah when that was going on? Is he what we was need to... 18, so he was of an OK age. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, obviously, extremely inappropriate. What, what, uh, hap what happened to Kate as a, as a result of that? Well, she got found out because the, the whole drama behind it was that my younger sister, Sophie, was in love with him. And then I was like, oh, I'll just go kiss him instead. So then, I oh know, so it got really nasty, and then Kate goes up the rails and blah, blah, blah. And the, the students, uh, how did they react? Not so well. <laughs> She's back at the school now, and everyone seems to have forgotten. It's, like it's amazing, isn't it? It's great, it's yeah. It's the miracle of soap. <laughs> yeah. Now, uh, still, at least our class uh, should listen when Kate hands out relationship advice to her students, as she does this very afternoon. Have a look at this. Eva. How are you doing? I'm uh, fine. Oh, good. So you're not feeling sick then? Don't forget we have tutoring after school today. Actually, about that, can we do it another day? You've already missed several lessons. Your mom's starting to worry. You told her. Well, I can't lie to her, and I'm already keeping your boyfriend a secret. You can't tell her, or Dad, they'll freak. Ember, is it physical, your relationship? Sorry? Well, are you taking precautions? Are you being safe? Can we not talk about this? Well, would you rather have this conversation with your parents? This is a compliment. They, they, they make you look older than you are. You look much younger in the flesh. I know. A lot of people say that. They say the same about me, too. Yeah, oh, good. Yeah. Uh, the thing we've got. <laughs> now, uh, who's got a question? I've got a question for you, Ashley. Oh, By the way, I love... No, it was fantastic. Okay. I have to ask you, though. Your, your mum is a teacher in real life and in, yeah. in, in the show. Does that help you with being in character? Do you know what? I think it did. Because a lot of people say, like, you know, I'm, I'm only 22. How do you go... Yeah talking as a teacher sort yeah. of thing and I've, I, feel, I feel like I've fell into the role really yeah. easily just because my mum actually taught me. Did she teach me. you? Yes. She did? She what taught me oh, and now she's, she was the principal of my school. It was actually great. Really? Yeah, we have a good relationship so we're very but lucky. But the other kids must have thought all the time, oh, you know, <laughs> there's favourite Ashley. I know but you'd think that but it, she's pretty cool and it wasn't, she'd never do that, you know what I mean? It was a good thing. But yeah, I, I found that I can hear myself when I say some lines and I sound like my mum and I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You all sound like our mum. Yeah. <laughs> what do you make of the reaction to Mrs. Thatcher's death? Um, yeah. You've been here a couple of weeks now. No, yes, no, no, I've been here so a couple of weeks and I was saying to you earlier, my biggest regret at this point in my life is not watching the Iron Lady on the plane. <laughs> because I was, I was like, maybe I'd know a thing or two about her and uh, going on the right stuff. Are you, surpri <laughs> are you surprised? I mean, there, there are people are, are, are spouting off about it everywhere. So, yeah. I mean, uh, including uh, your Prime Minister back home, Julia Gillard, of course. She's, uh, yes, well, I she's guess, come to praise her. I guess my take on it as someone who uh, I'm quite naive to, I don't really know much at well, all, to and, be and totally says, honest about you, her. You, you, you were born well after yes, she gave and in her. a different country, but well, um, I think the biggest shock for me is how much she actually was disliked. Mm. I honestly didn't realise it was this severe. Mm. So I think that's kind of taken me by shock. Okay. Is, um, Can I ask you, have you been to this country before? No. So this is your first time? Yes, this is my first visit Thanks to London. Thanks for bringing the weather, actually. <laughs> <laughs> we really appreciate it. I know, I was saying, it was snowing last week, and I was like, oh, it's snowing, I'm in the city, and everyone's looking at me is like, that the it's first, such no, a tourist. Because half the Australians that come here say, you all think that we've never seen the snow. Have you seen snow before? Um, I have seen snow before, but never in a city, and that takes you by surprise. Because yeah. I've seen it, like, you know, beautiful landscape, blah, blah, blah. Overall, your impression, I mean, because it's, 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 it's been... I think it's been quite hard for tourists, actually, because the weather has been really miserable. It, uh, and yeah. it doesn't show us off to our best, either. No, but, but I, I know that this, and this is not meant to sound bad, but you kind of expect it when you come here. <laughs> like, it's kind of known, isn't it, for it's not yeah. so great weather. Yeah. I mean, come to Australia. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you yeah. want good weather. But, um, no, I like it. Okay. I kind of like cities when they're a little bit cosy like this. Now, did you follow uh, Ryan Maloney's adventures in the Big Brother house? <laughs> yeah, I did. Would that be something you would be tempted to do? <laughs> 
Uh, I don't think, only because I'm, I'd be a really boring contestant, I think. I'd sit there and I wouldn't want to cause trouble and I'd always know that there were cameras and I'd just be like, I'm just going to sit here and be quiet. Really? <laughs> yeah. It'd be fun, I'm sure. It'd be sure. fun to do? Yeah, it would be fun. Okay, okay. Yeah. Well, it's great to have you with us. I hope you find uh, the next hour and a, oh, just under two hours uh, fun and entertaining as well.